Have you ever had that experience where someone walks into a room or your office and they're in a great mood and all of a sudden it lifts everybody? Or you've had someone walk in who's had one of those days and all of a sudden everyone starts getting snippy. Well, science has now discovered that each of us who are in an intense emotional state can influence all of the people around us. And if you're not aware of this, and if you can't take control of your response, you're going to be at the mercy of all those people around you. Years ago, there was um, a scientist that observed that there a wall full of clocks that had pendulums all going at a different rate, right? They, so they were all going tick tock, tick tock, all at different rates. But what happened, which is really interesting, was that a day later, or not even that, all of a sudden, all of those clocks were in perfect synchronization going tick. And what he discovered is that the clock that had the largest magnet, electromagnetic field around it with its movement started pulling the clocks around it into synchronization with it. That created a larger field which then pulled others and others until they were all moving at precisely the same rate. This is something called entrainment. Now, your heart, which has a secondary brain. We've discovered there's another brain in our bodies, in our hearts. Its electromagnetic field is the largest in the body and you can actually measure it several feet out <clears throat> with a magnetometer. And it changes based on your emotional state. The, the interesting thing is, in terms of basic physical responses, it can be measured um, a dozen feet away easily with, with, a, with an instrument. If you take quantum effects into account, anybody that you've interacted with, and particularly people you interact with a lot, there's no range. So the, there's a change in your electromagnetic field from your emotional state, it will influence them. Okay? So this is why someone walks in to a, a room and they are in a great state, they're feeling great, all of a sudden others start to lift. Or what happens unfortunately more often than not is someone walks in who is really in a foul mood. That ele electromagnetic field permeates, starts to pull others into that state. It's just like taking a tuning fork and hitting it and bringing it near another fork that's a similar frequency. It starts resonating at that frequency. And as it does that, it moves people into that emotional state. So if you're not aware of this, then every time that happens, you're at the beck and call of whoever's got the most intense emotions around you. If you notice that happening, if you're aware of it, uh, you, can, uh, you can take action. The simplest thing, if someone comes in who's really, really upset, and it could be a customer you're dealing with or another employee or family member, start to notice that. Be aware that of this and the fact that they are literally radiating that emotion electromagnetically. And if you do something as simple as trigger the relaxation response, which is breathe nice and deep and regularly, you can keep yourself centered so that their electromagnetic field doesn't carry you along like a tidal wave into their emotional state. It's something as simple as that that will let you take control back of your life and of your emotions, so you're not at the mercy of everyone around you.